Mystery God here back with another video. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to smash that subscribe button, turn on the post notification bell, and give this video a big thumbs up. Alright guys, we are back with week 4 challenges on the Deadpool. So let's go ahead and get right into his little Deadpool cave and whatnot. Let's go ahead and jump right into the computer. Alright, Deadpool week 4. So it says find Deadpool's katanas. So obviously boom there you got there you go there's your very first one it even says it right there in very 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 big letters boom that's one of them so let's see if there's what else okay so i guess there's another one let's go ahead and get that one so if you guys don't know where the second location is the second location is going to be right where the upgrade vault is and you would go right into the upgrade vault and it's going to be right here right behind everything else so, the, so Deadpool's Katana is going to be right there, behind that one, and that is part two of the challenge, guys. Let's go ahead and get into, let's get back into the layer, open up the computer, what else is left? Deal damage to opponent structure. Alright, I'm going to show you guys how you can deal damage to opponent structure as soon as I load into a game. So I'm going to load into a game real quick, guys, and I'm going to show you guys how you can do opponent structure. I don't know how much opponent structure you have to do, so I'll let you guys know as soon as I get into the match. So stay tuned and I'll show you how to do that. Alright guys, I have looted up pretty good enough to show you guys exactly how to complete the challenge. So right over here, as you can see, this is red. I can't edit anything from that. So whenever you go to the Deadpool Challenger, it says um, deal damage to opponent structure. So ten, I gotta deal 10,000 damage. So just like that, as you can see, we're going to come right over to here and right over here, it says 140. So what you have to do is you have to find anything that's opponent wise, like anything that your teammates didn't do or anything your opponent did and you have to destroy it. Now the easiest way you can do this guys, the easiest way you can do this is if you go like either to wherever their base is or where everyone's battling. And I would say like quite a bit of grenades you can throw or you can throw a lot of uh, C4s or anything in that area. That would probably be like my number one guess. Or if you're going to be around here, what you can do is you can always grab a minigun. You can always grab a minigun and just demolish everything just like that. That would probably be one of the easiest and funnest way to also do this challenge. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and complete the challenge, guys, and then I'm gonna show you guys what the reward is for completing it as well. So stick around. I'm gonna show you guys at the end of this match. All right, guys. As you can see, we are almost there. We are almost done with the challenge. So basically, what I'm gonna show you guys how to do is I'm gonna show you guys how to finish the rest of it. So right now I'm almost done. I have a little bit of bullets left in my minigun to complete it. So we should be almost done with the challenge, you guys. And right there, boom. Oh, we just missed it, but yeah, there you go, guys. That is how you can complete the challenge and get it going. 10,000 damage to structures in one game. That is pretty insane. And guys, if you guys pick up the exact same loot that I picked up and pick up a minigun uh, or like an AR or anything in, the, in, in that category, if you pick it up, I promise this challenge is gonna be so much more easier to complete and so much more fun to do. So I highly recommend picking up, getting one of those, uh, getting a minigun from from Team Rumble. And as soon as you've gotten the minigun from the Team Rumble, it's gonna be this challenge is gonna be so much more easier for you to complete. All right, guys. Now let's go ahead and leave the match. Let's go ahead and leave the match and see what reward we will have possibly picked up for completing the challenge. Let's go ahead and check it out. Okay, so here's one. Oh, we got a nice cool little banner. Let's go. All right, we got an epic style. 
Oh, let's go. We got the back wing Deadpool's katanas. Oh my god, let's go. Honestly, this is such a perfect, perfect back wing for this. Boom. Just like that, guys. And that is how you complete this challenge. That is how you get all those three cool little extras rewards in the game and you get his katanas. So that's it for this video guys, thank you guys for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next one, enjoy.